Hello, fam. Welcome. My name is Magdalene Janet. If you are new, welcome to the fam. Please don't forget to like and subscribe because we're always here having a good time. And come visit me on TikTok and Instagram because I'm there daily and always having a good time. And of course, welcome back to my oldies but goodies. So you guys, Maybelline is doing it again. They are releasing five additional shades from their Super State vinyl line. I'm so sorry. I did not screenshot but thank you so much to my girl that told me on instagram about these i had no idea they were coming out with five brand new shades and you know i got you today the sun is beaming so if you are new welcome what i usually do is lip swatch the entire collection at the very beginning in studio lighting and in daylight and then towards the end of the video we talk about it and i think i'm gonna do a bit of a wear test and an eat test today because we got time i did lip swatch the original 10 shades i will link that video down below if you haven't checked it out that video was so much fun and as always i never have anything on my lips so that's why i look a little bit crusty i always want you to see the actual color of the lipstick so they're shade 70 to 90 i'm just gonna go in that order you first have to shake them to activate them and then this is how they look just like the original packaging beautiful of course let's just get started i'm gonna show you the order we're gonna go in on my phone and then let's start the lip swatches all right fam here they are this is the order we're gonna go in since it's smallest number to largest but look how pretty these sheets are so freaking beautiful and look ah and you can see the shades are at the bottom and let's start starting off with shade number 70 moody This is Moody. And in daylight, this is Moody. This has a bit of a mauve tone. And up is 75 Hot. This is the shade hot. And in daylight, this is hot. This is a magenta pink shade. Next one up is 80 eccentric. This is the shade Eccentric. And in daylight, this is Eccentric. This is like a red pink shade. Next one up is 85 Restless. Shade Restless. And in daylight, this is Restless. This is more of a peachy shade. Last but not least is number 90, is Dainty. This is the shade Dainty. And in daylight, this is Dainty. We have a bit more of a lighter mauve shade. 
Hey fam, this is it. This is the fifth and final lip swatch. Oh my God, and I still hold my teeth. I have noticed that these do budge on the teeth. So keep in mind, a trick I always like to do is this. And then it gets rid of like the circular part in the mouth, you know? Now comes in five additional shades. This is a budge resistant vinyl color and up to 16 hour wear. This lipstick color formula defies budging and transfer and provides an instant shine finish. I purchased mine at Target. The formula is exactly the same as the original. Very soft and gentle. It's literally a lightweight formula that glides beautifully onto the skin. Not the skin, the lips. And the Dofa is bomb because I rarely, rarely messed up. It's so small, you're able to really lip line your lips. Just super helpful in case you don't like to wear lip liners and just like to use one color and call it a day. I typically do that because, I don't know, unless I want to mix stuff, I'll use lip liners, lip gloss, and matte lipsticks. But if I just want to use one product, I want it to work well that time. You know, it's just easy one, throw it in your bag and you're good to go. So I really like that the Dofa foot is perfect because I don't have the biggest lips. I don't have a huge defined cupid's bow, so that's helpful. These colors I feel like are more in the pink and mauve tone, which is cool. I really, really like them. I think they're very, very nice. I will say though that these two shades, 75 hot and 8 restless, went on very sheer. Had to wait maybe about 30 seconds for them to dry and then add another layer because they went on super sheer and kind of patchy. These are the lighter shades. Lighter shades can do that it'll just look a little wonky but it's just because you just need to build them up the other three which are the darker shades went all beautifully it was kind of like one swipe and you had like the full pigment i didn't really have to go over twice i mean i did because i just like the color to be specific for you for the most part they're pretty pigmented here are the swatches i feel like they swatch beautifully you can tell they're a little bit sheer but actually i do want to show you the swatches in sunlight so you guys can get a clear view on how they look what the undertone tones are they are very pinky and a little bit of mauve so that's like the color range Maybelline went with this time I'm pretty sure Maybelline will come out with more because these are so popular like they did with the Superstay original matte lipsticks you know how they came out with the coffee edition the birthday edition the red edition so I'm pretty sure if they come out with a coffee or nude edition girl you know I'm all up in there because oh that'll be perfect they're not as shiny as you would think they are matte so let's see the transfer you see, when you kiss, it's like a shiny layer comes off, but the color stays on the lips. You know what I'm saying? Like the shine is not there, but if I add another layer, we get the shine back. They have a little scent too. They have the scent like the original ones and like the Super Stay Matte original original. And I can smell it. I know a lot of you guys don't like scented lip products. You guys know I'm really sensitive to scent. But overall, I like these. I think these are cute. These are perfect for the summer. These shades are very, very nice and they would go with so many skin tone, which is very, very important. I do like that these shades are different from the original 10. Maybelline does a good job in adding shades that don't look similar to what they already have. I really, really appreciate that. I've compared a lot of the shades and they don't look the same, you know? So that's bomb. I'm gonna insert the wear test here. I'm thinking if I should have a salad tonight or pizza and see how these last I wish you could tell me but I don't know I'm really leaning towards pizza but we'll see all right you guys it's been about two hours no three it's almost eight o'clock this is how the lips look I haven't eaten or anything I just had water but look they've mattified okay BRB I ended up getting the salad because the pizza place was unavailable so here we are <laughs> All right, fam, I'm calling it a night. Been about five hours. Hold on, this is not good lighting. Okay, the room's better lighting. This hair has been just like that. So it did come off, like you see right there. So kind of cutting in, yesterday I had a salad and the lipstick kind of faded at the end. The day I just put shade 70 Moody at around 10.30 and I was like, you know what? Let's do a second day wear test. Why not, you know? And it looks good. It's been three hours. I've only had water and look. The lips look really good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this shade's better too. Yesterday was a little too pinky for me. I got the pizza. So let's eat some pizza. I've been craving pizza since yesterday and I could not get it. I got three slices, okay? Oh dang, I forgot my ranch. So let's grub. 
by the way the lipstick doesn't feel heavy you can feel it you know something's there so keep that in mind and also it has a bit of a shine but the matte part is what makes it stay so it's like a shiny matte you know because i got that question in my first video i'm like oh let me just answer it All right, just finished eating. Nothing like pizza and a Coke. Mm -mm -mm. Let's look at the lips. You see, yeah, the bottom comes off. For the most part, it looks good, you know? So yeah, just wanted to show you a quick eat test. Well, a two-day eat test. And I forgot to mention, these shades are only available at Target. At the moment, I'm sure it will expand. And they retail for 10 bucks. Just keep in mind that they're only at Target. And yeah, back to the outro <laughs> So yeah, this is it. Let me know your thoughts on this. Have you tried them at all? Now there's 15 shades before there was only 10. Honestly, these are all my favorite. I think I just like them all. I think I can wear them every single day because the shades work out so well. They're not too bright. They're not too dark. They're perfect. I don't know. They all look so bomb. But yeah, okay. I love you guys so much. Thank you for hanging out with me and spending a little bit of your day with me. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, click the button right there, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.